how to add Google Pay to Shopify. Hey guys, welcome back. If you are looking to get started with your Shopify store, it's very essential to have multiple different types of payment methods available. And Google Pay can be an amazing option for your customers to be able to check out on your Shopify store. It's simple and easy and effective when you are trying to get more sales channels, you're trying to funnel more people through your sales channel, and you're trying to provide as many payment methods possible because not everyone wants to pay through their credit card or have to go through the multiple measures that they might have. And these online payment applications or tools help people in providing payment. So I'm going to cover step by step how you can add Google Pay. However, there is one thing you need to keep into consideration whenever you are adding Google Pay to your Shopify store. It is whether or not Google Pay is actually enabled in your country. So Google Pay is enabled in a lot of different countries. You can go on to the Google support page and this is a list of countries where you can use the pay online or in applications feature because this is going to be a pay online feature. So if your country is included or, you know, the country where you're trying to provide your Shopify services or goods, if it is included in these nations, then you can easily provide Google Pay options to your customers. However, if you're located elsewhere, then you're not going to be able to accept or receive your Google Pay payments. And if you take a look at the Shopify Help Center, you will find more information as to the requirements of Google Pay. So if we go on to Google Pay requirements, you can see there are some basic requirements which enable you to use Google Pay. So you guys can see your store must adhere to the Google Pay API terms of service and acceptable use policy. And you also have to make sure that you are, uh, you know, Google Pay is not available to merchants located in France who use Shopify payments. So these are things to keep into consideration when you are launching Google Pay on your Shopify store. Now, to get started, simply log on to your Shopify store. Once you're in your Shopify store, you can click on your settings and then you will see on your bottom left, you have your settings. The pop up of settings will open up from here. You can scroll down and you will see multiple different checkout and payment options. So you have your checkout and this is your basic checkout information. But then you have your payment information on the left side in this control panel. Now. You will see your payment methods. I have currently just added a bogus getaway and then you have manual payment methods. So to accept Google Pay, you can click on add payment method over here. This will open up the payment method providers and you can choose what kind of payment method you're looking for. So you can search for a particular provider or you can search for a particular payment method. I recommend that you just simply find a provider that covers all types of payments that you want to accept on your Shopify store. So if on your Shopify store, you want to provide Visa, MasterCard, American Express, and Google Pay, try to find a provider that provides all of those payments. However, you can use a different type of provider as well. Now, we're just going to search for Google Pay and I'm just going to search for Google Pay over here. Now, as you guys can see that Google Pay is not showing up for our provider currently, that is because Google Pay might not be available in my region. So just to do a double check, I'm just going to search for GPay or just search for Google. And you guys can see the payment provider cannot be found. Now, if I search for Shopify payment, that is not found. However, if you go on to the supported countries for Shopify payment, you will see all of the countries that are available that have Shopify payment. So keep in mind, this is available uh, for only businesses that have two-step uh, verification online. So let's click on over here and you can simply go on ahead, go to your store settings and you can go into your store details. You will have your currency, billing information, order IDs and all of your basic information then you have your plan as well a lot of the times if you choose a plan 
on Shopify. So if you click on update payment method and you add your payment method, then you are usually available for Shopify payments. And with Shopify payments, you also get access to Google Pay. So if I go on ahead and click on my payments over here, uh, you guys can see providers that enable you to accept payment methods. Uh, an additional fee will apply to your new orders once you select a plan. So I will click on choose a provider and you guys can see these payment methods are all third party application. Now, if you want to use Shopify payments, then you should definitely make sure that you are enabling two step authentication on your Shopify store as well as selecting a plan. So to do that, you can click on settings over here. Once I go into my settings, I am going to go into my plan and once i go into my plan you can get a free trial for shopify for three days and then for only one dollar a month you can get started uh, for the next three months on any plan so you can click on update payment method and you can click on add payment method from here you can provide all of your information and i'm going to complete that now i've just completed my payment verification so i have completed my payment information now once you have completed your payment information you want to go into my store on the top right and then once you click on that you want to click on manage account once you do that on the left side of your screen you want to click on security and once you click on security you can scroll down and you will find the option of two-factor authentication or two-step authentication so you want to click on two-step authentication you're going to click on re-authenticate and then you will re-authenticate your account from over here like so and then click on continue over here and what this enables you to do is that a lot of payment methods are not available unless you have completed these authentications so then you can set up your phone number and your code so i'm gonna do that and i'm gonna get back to you guys in a second so as you guys can see i have multiple different types of authentications available you have the authenticator app you have a shopify mobile prompt you also have security keys sms and any built-in authenticator so you can turn this on click on continue and then you can use any of your own shopify methods to authenticate whichever one you prefer and once you do that you can just download the codes like this and then once you do that, your two-step authentication will be turned on. Now you can go back into your Shopify store. So if we go back into our store over here, you will see all of your information will be updated. And if Shopify payment is available in your region, you can click on settings, click on payments over here and click on choose a provider. Once you click on choose a provider, any of the previous methods that were not available to you will now be available. So if you go on ahead, go for payments over here, click on choose a provider and you can search for Google Pay or any other provider that provides Google Pay and have that added. Currently, Google Pay is not available in my region, so I cannot directly add it. But if it is available in your region by authenticating your account and setting up your payment method, you will be able to use Google Pay in your region. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And I will catch you guys in the next video.